Hello and welcome to the tech update of this week. This is Solva. Huawei's Harmony OS is gradually becoming the go-to operating system in the Chinese market. Today, we are diving deeper into yet another groundbreaking update. Now, latest updates suggest that the Chinese automaker Neo is currently testing a humanoid robot. This humanoid robot is equipped with no other software but Huawei's Harmony operating system. This therefore makes this humanoid robot the first ever humanoid robot to be equipped with Huawei's Harmony operating system. As much as Huawei already had plans to equip more electronic gadgets with the Harmony OS, for the past three years, Huawei has been more focused on the deployment of this operating system in gadgets such as smartphones, tablets, smart TVs, and other IoT devices. So this move by Neo and Huawei indicates that Huawei has gained more confidence in the performance of the Harmony operating system. If this test being conducted by Neo becomes successful, in the near future, we are likely to see the deployment of humanoid robots equipped with Harmony operating systems in production facilities in China. No. Neo intends to use the humanoid robots powered by Huawei's Harmony operating system in their car manufacturing plants in China. Neo believes that the deployment of humanoid robots powered by Huawei's Harmony operating system will ensure efficiency in their manufacturing plants. Currently, the Chinese electric vehicle market is witnessing stiff competition, leading to price war among competing brands such as BYD, Tesla, and Neo. As a result of this competition, Electric vehicle manufacturers in China are looking for innovative ways to beat production costs down. This therefore is one of the few reasons pushing electric vehicle manufacturers in China and even beyond China to look for innovative ways they can automate majority of their production activities by integrating robots into their assembly lines. As much as the adaptation of robots into assembly lines in China is on the rise, Neo on the other hand seems to be taking the lead to Towards the adaptation of humanoid robots into their production facilities. Per reports, Neo is currently conducting a test with this humanoid robot in their two main production plants in China. Now, the focus of this test is to enable Neo ascertain how efficient their production lines can become. If they integrate these humanoid robots powered by Harmony OS into their production activities. Now, this robot is the first ever humanoid robot built upon the Pangu Large model. Which is an AI language model learned by Huawei in 2021 that is powered by the Harmony operating system. This humanoid robot was introduced to the public at the just ended Huawei developer conference in China, where we saw the robot performing some few tasks such as cooking, sweeping, and laundry activities. Now, if this test being conducted by Neo goes through successfully, we are likely to be seeing this humanoid robot from Neo become the first ever humanoid robot fully equipped with a Harmony operating system being deployed commercially. The long-term goal of Huawei is to promote the usage of the Harmony operating system in both industrial and consumer sectors around the world. So this move by Neo is in the right direction towards making this goal by Huawei become a reality. What do you think about this? Kindly let me know your thoughts in the comment section and if you find this content informative, kindly not forget to subscribe so you don't miss my next updates. Peace out.